first all the water is let out. This creates a great deal of turbulence. When all the water's out, then the doors start to open. And it takes a while for the doors to get fully open, but when the doors are open, the water inside the lock and outside the lock are at exactly the same level. When the lock is open, the boat can just simply drive right in and the boat is going to uh, go alongside one wall or the other. You see those uh, grooves down the side of the lock walls. Those have uh, either pipes or cables. In this particular lock, which is the Erie Canal Lock E2, it has the cables and it fills up and when it's all the way up to the top, the boat cheerfully cruises out the other end.